Yes, we're on. We're on. I think we've got a barrier here. So she's going to cook the mangrove jack for us. How are we going to cook it tonight, darling? Um, we're going to do lemon, garlic, and butter, and just shallow fry it in the pan. There we go. That should be pretty good. Alright, so we're going to get the pan ready. So skin side down first. All right, morning guys. Welcome back for another episode. This one I'm out on my own. Kids are doing homeschool. They've got a fair bit to do, so it's a big day. Got a couple of meetings with the teachers, so I'm on my own. Just me and the midges, they're everywhere. But yeah, I'm off again. Thank you, Shay. She is very good to me. Let's go fishing on my own all the time. Makes me lunch. Got a beautiful packed lunch in the boat. Makes me dinner. She looks after me well. Anyway, we're going to try and get a barra. So I'm here now. I was here, I was here all day yesterday and didn't get none. Me and Reese, we fished hard, jumped one off and missed one. Swiped my jerk bait, missed it on shooting with barra. Anyway, tides are a little bit different today. Tides are real funny up here in the territory. It's like, yeah, they're different. They're not up and down, they're either up and then flat, then down, and they're all over the place. Anyway, we've got a little bit longer today before we have the same tide as we did yesterday, which is where I'm gonna go up back. There's a flat here, I'm gonna fish this flat now. See how we go, give a half hour, and then I'm gonna sit up the back. All right, I'm gonna get these rods in the water, and let's go. So hopefully, old batter is down there waiting for feed too. Yes, we're on. Oh, we're on here. I hope it's a barra. What is it? Oh, he's got me stuck on something. What do we got? What a pain that was. Oh, we got me stuck on my own. We got Jack. Anyway, on my own, had me wrapped around a tree. I just had to start the motor to come in and he come off. It's not the barrel that I'm after, which I just saw one explode here. But it's a jack, so that's all right. Nice mangrove jack. 38. So I'll keep him, I'll bleed him. He's 38. My little key tech swing impact. I'll fix me lure. 
and keep fishing this point here. I saw a big barra bust up here. So my PB mangrove jack. So Shay will cook that up beautiful. Right, so we've got a nice barra to go with him. So I'm going to go back up. There's this muddy bank where I was this morning. I had one bust up. I stopped just in front of him. He busted up back here. I'm going to go up there now and drift back along it because I missed a fish before this. Then I got him, assuming it was the same fish, probably just this jack. But yeah, we'll fish this muddy bank where the bait seems to be getting pushed back. I'm on the bait's coming on the front, and the fish is sitting here waiting for the bait that comes around that corner. All right, let's go get them. All right. I think we've got a barrier here. Yep, this is a barrier. He's got me in something again. He's out. We've got a barra. I saw him up there busting, terrorising. Oh, he's got me in another thing. Fishing pretty hard in the area. There he is. Come on, I can feel him in a tree. Woo, we've got a barra. Let's get him in the boat. See me No! He's gone. He got off. Well, we had a barrel. I just saw him swim off. Oh, no. He's still there. Oh, it's not a barrel, it's another jack. Big jack. Anyway. Whew. I thought that was a barra. Alright, so we've brightened one day from my broken glasses. Have a go at that for a jack. Anyway, so what happened? There are any busting everywhere. The barra, and the point up there where I saw the barra bust and I got a jack. I've come around and there's a big shallow flat in here and there's no tide moving, it's dead still. And the barra are just going crazy. So I cast in, I thought I had a barra, I cast it just in front of one that buffed. Got this guy, this guy ran into a tree. I had to come over to get him out. There must have been a barra sitting on top of that tree that I've come over. And when I'm up here trying to get this this um, jack out, thinking I had it with me barra, I saw a barra. It's probably 80. Took off. Went that way. I thought, oh, I lost me, lost me barra because I couldn't because it was completely snagged, completely wrapped around. Anyway, so I sat down. Thought, oh, there goes me barra. And off it goes again. So I still had him, but it wasn't a barra. It was a jack. But I tell you what. I'm not complaining. I'm over the moon with this. This is my biggest ever jack. Let's measure him. Get him right. He's got a nice speed of jack anyway. He is 45. What a fish, eh? A beautiful fish. I'm going to get back into it. The barra still all around and the jack and I'm going to try and get myself a barra. I'm happy. I'm happy with a couple of jacks. Hadn't caught a legal jack. Just caught two legal jacks in five minutes. All right, we are back again for Shay's cooking. I didn't catch any more fish. I jumped one more bar off that day. It wasn't very big, probably 40. I didn't bother showing it in the video because you can't see anything. You just see me go, oh, I'm on, and then oh, I jumped it off. He comes straight up now. Anyway, we're back here for the gorgeous Shay. Look at my wife. She is stunning. How are you going? Stop it. Uh, anyway, so she's going to cook the mangrove jack for us. How are we going to cook it tonight, darling? Um, we're going to do lemon, garlic and butter and just shallow fry it in the pan. There we go. That should be pretty good. Alright, well, I'll get my mug out of this thing and let's let Shay take over. <laughs> Alright, on the fish, baby. On the fish? Yeah. We're going to cut it into sections. Mark's giving me his good knife. I'm trusted with it today. Make sure the way the bar is still a knife today. Just about this size. We're going to do it with the skin on, so we'll crisp the skin, 
like that side first and then we'll flip it and cook the other side. So I'll just get this cut up and then I'll show you how to prepare it. Well done, baby. Look at the steaks on that. So we get plain flour, pepper. This is just for the seasoning. Put it in the flour. It just makes it fry a bit nicer. Alright, so we're going to get the pan ready. We have. I better turn it on. We just want a medium heat, not too hot. Okay, so we've got ginger, garlic. Butter. There's planes near an army base. You're right there, free spirit. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, turn this off while they come past. Okay, lemon. And then we have basil. Inside down first. Um, so skin side down first, and then we'll just put the lid back on. It will take two to three minutes. We'll give it a flip, and then it'll be another two to three minutes. And we'll have a beautiful flip. I'll tell you what, it smells good. Come the bell. Yeah. It smells wonderful. I'm excited for this mango jack. Me too. I haven't eaten mango jack before. And this isn't my wife dressed up. Either. This is how she cooks dinner for me every night, just so you know. This is spoiled, man. Yep. Every day I get home from fishing, this is what I get, and she cooks my dinner. <laughs> okay, we'll give it a flip. Check this out. That smells good. Our first lot's Fish. You just keep repeating the process till all your fish is cooked and then we'll serve it up. All right. We'll come back in a minute. Okay, our fish is all done. We've made a salad down here. When I serve it up, I just get my piece of fish. And I'll pop it straight on there. Some lemon. And that's it. There we go, we just put lemon all over it. I 
does that look? Pretty good to me, doll. All right, I hope you enjoyed Shay's cooking again. And she's just trying to hide. Anyway, beautiful Shay done a good job again. We're gonna eat this. We'll have a look, see how it looks. It looks beautiful, smells beautiful. I'm sure it's great. Thanks for watching. That is amazing. Look at that. Oh. Beautiful. Thank you. All right, we're gonna get in this. Kids were just calling back through like the jump pillar. They come back for lunch now, and yeah. All right, thank you, Dale.